Yeah, I was about 45 when I first noticed my hip loss. Well, at, at first it really didn't bother me too much, just because I was a little bit older and that would be about it. I never thought it would get as thin as it did. I really didn't hit me, uh, uh, but you know, I'll, I'll be frank with you, I probably didn't like my picture being taken as, as often. Well, you know, in my office, I realized I was the oldest guy there, and I was starting to look older and older and older. And uh, you know, the business I'm in is a, it's a young man's business, so I thought maybe I'd get a little more. It was fine. but much quicker and easier than I thought. I told some people in my office. I'm just amazed at how many people come up to me and say, you get a great head of hair. Uh, several people asked me if I had a hair transplant. As a matter of fact, when it first took place, I, you know, to be frank, I lied a couple of times. I said no, but then I went back and told them. I said, yeah, I said, you know what, I lied. Sorry, I lied to you the first time. I got my hair transplant. And they were what? amazed. <laughs> they couldn't believe that there's no other took it, yeah. I have recommended Dr. Bolton to others, uh, and I, I, I'll continue to recommend Dr. Bolton to others. Thanks a lot, Doc. Okay. I feel like a million bucks. You know, I, I, I'd recommend anybody who's uh, who's losing their hair and is looking for an alt, a safe alternative. This is the only way to go.